So basically we fought, There's that's not clickbait. We got into a physical altic altercation last night. Oh, y'all need to go get that drunk bitch some water. How rude of you. To exactly. They're so right How though. stupid. <laughs> no, get the off me. Was this in front of everybody? If you told yes. me this was. But. No, get to the car. <laughs> She's like, no. She just knocked me out. I would have much rather preferred her to knock me the out and drag my ass to my car. I was like, I don't know what. I decided, come on, with these lousy bitches. Oh my god, my god, I can't take this. I can't take this shit. You manipulated me! I could have like like ran away from her. No, you needed to beat my ass. No. After everything you told me. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. So, we fought twice. We fought twice. Yes. So worry about that five dollars in them cash shops and stop worrying about us. Just in case you're seeing this, Dusty. Very what she said. <laughs> what she said. <laughs>
Okay, so we're at a link day. It's a link day. And we're like, we've been planning like, oh my God, let's have girl time. Like, oh my God, we've been wanting to do this. And so we're already currently drinking throughout the day, but nothing serious, nothing heavy. So the plan was to go to karaoke and um, uh, it was, we were just gonna sing karaoke, like get a little tipsy, whatever, get, well, that was the plan. But knowing me, that's not what the fuck I'm gonna do. <laughs> so it was just gonna get, be like, get a little tipsy, go do karaoke, then leave, you know, whatever it was. Hmm. We were like, at first we were gonna go to a liquor store, but then we was like, bro, we already finna go to Wawa. I was like, should we just four loco it? Don't ever don't do for loco. loco. Do not do for loco. Oh, that got that got some kind That's of something the in there. That I don't fucking that know. That shit is dangerous. I'm telling you, like it's really like worse than alcohol. Do not for loco it. We got like four four locos, or we got four locos for each one of us, and then we and I found the extra one and I threw it away. I was like, yes, fuck, bro, no, fuck, no, no more of them. Mm -mm. And we got four other ones. I don't know what they were, but they tasted they good, too. good. Yeah, it was, that was good. <laughs> we just said the same thing. That bitch was actually really good, like juice. For real. But guys, don't drink. All right, we get there. We get there. We're like in in the parking lot at Ebor, and I loved this moment for us. Yes. Like this moment was actually a good, genuinely good time. We were like we opened the doors to my car we were jamming like music on my radio and we were having our own party literally our own karaoke in the fucking right parking, in the parking lot, lot. Mm -hmm. and like shaking ass we was listening to music vibing. we was vibing it was really it was a good moment y'all but <laughs> but life does not work that way right you get good and then you get bad mm -hmm. it just is what it is so uh currently i'm in a state where um i'm like just in my head right so what i was doing that in that moment was like drinking 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 and i did not have limits i did not have a limit and if you've seen if you've seen the video that me and ad filmed on his youtube bro i just remember the same shit happens to us every time we drink in orlando remember mm -hmm. we lost our phones yeah. like guys drinking like to get obliterated is never a good idea take it from me please i'm mm. telling you it, it's always ended out bad like it's, that every time it's been something happened and this was just the the third time it was gotta <laughs> listen to <laughs> this was like the one That's like this it. Like, you gotta listen to this shit. like that was like for real for real sign mm -hmm. oh my god so i'm drinking 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 we're getting emotional you know and then we, we had a moment then too we was all crying we was oh, all yeah. like all embracing each other making each other feel it was like a real moment it really it really was a good time it's just mm -hmm. now look this is why i'm telling you not to drink because after like sitting all i remember is sitting on outside of the parking lot uh the parking lot garage floor mm -hmm. It's like the driveway right when you go to get out. We saw one of our friends that was there with us. It was two other friends with us. And we saw, I saw her and I was sitting with her, like comforting her because she was crying and stuff like that. That's all I remember. I don't remember nothing else. After this, this is why I say do not get blackout wasted because I had no control over what I was doing. And it's so embarrassing to think that other people saw me the way that I was and I don't remember. Everybody else remembers but me. That's so embarrassing. Now she's gonna take because I don't remember. <laughs> okay, so right after we left the garage, we started walking down. It's it's like the strip. If y'all know where the strip is, it's like downtown where all the clubs are. And we it was like a karaoke place we were supposed to be going to there. So our friend had to use the bathroom, so we stopped to the 7-Eleven. We walk in at this time. We stopped to the 7-Eleven, and she used the bathroom. I get a coffee just in case. You drunk some of my coffee. I did. Yes, I, I'm. I forgot. I don't know how the fuck that I coffee don't didn't do shit. Remember nothing. That don't made drink. it worse. Really? Yeah, I think some something that you drink makes you drunk drunker than what it is. That I think it was the fucking coffee, cause after after we got out of the 7-eleven we got coffee we was in the 7-eleven talking and like um chilling for like 10 minutes 10 15 minutes and we're walking down the street it's a whole bunch of guys they like they see we drunk and they just they was trying to talk to us trying to bother us trying to solicit us Ooh, what does that mean and word of the day <laughs> <laughs> that mean like they trying to to they was trying to get us to have Oh, they was trying to get us to have.
Um, they was like, um, me and my four boys in the, in the car over here, where y'all finna go? We'll take y'all with us and we'll bring y'all back here a little later and we just do something. So one of our friends, she immediately was going to try to fight him. As she's trying to fight him, I look in the truck where the other guys are because I'm trying to see everybody, you know, just in case, whatever. I see him grabbing his gun out his his um, glove compartment and putting it on his lap. And I'm like, oh, wait, y'all. Uh-oh, wait, wait. Don't don't even be mad. Don't even be mad. <laughs> when i was like okay let me be i see everybody else is a little more um drunk than i am let me keep drinking some coffee let me sober up so just in I'm case so sorry no it's okay just in case then you walk over you put your entire arm in his window seal bro and you like hi puppy what's going on puppy it's okay Koro. something like that and i'm like um oh y'all yeah. no <laughs> I'm like, i swear okay. this is not me I have you ever seen me do that no that's not ever that. like that's oh when I knew. That's when I knew something was going on. I said, "Nah, get the cringy." I said, "Get the fuck over there, wait, let him go, 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 At least he was your type. He was my type. He was your type. Now, Yelly, what's wrong with you? You it was like two in the car. That was your type. But it was like after the other guy. I feel like I I genuinely feel like they was about to do some sneaky shit though. If we would have went with them, because it was just one, it just gave human traffic vibes. Oh, like and so I was like, nah, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. And I'm like, I'm trying to scoot your your nails and your fingers out his window seal so we can go. And you, I'm like, nah, I'm whispering in your ear, nah. He got a motherfucking gun. Let's go. You said. I did? Yes. Girl, and we immediately walked away. I, I knew at that point, I knew everybody was drunk. We was uh, It was a security guard that was literally right there. And he was like, yeah, I heard what he said, but y'all good. Y'all good. Just keep walking. Have a good time. And so we was like, okay, we're going to keep walking. We keep walking and we end up at the karaoke place we were supposed to go to. And it's like 2.30 at this, at this time. So they was like that you were too drunk. And so we couldn't go in. Oh my God! How was and I acting? Like how was I? You, I mean, we. You was doing a lot of wobbling. You was doing a lot of like. Really? Like because in order for somebody to say, "You can't come in here," I must mm -hmm. have been. Fucking. You was like, and but you was like, you know what? It's okay. <laughs> I value you as a person, and I just, I just want you to have a good day after work. <laughs> door i was like well shit do y'all do karaoke and will y'all let us in we just want to sing a song oh that's my it God, we ruined our fucking and he night. was no he was like no but y'all can take her home though and that's when i was like oh she must be fucking drunk like too drunk we should just leave yeah so we was just like all right we gonna leave when we go and turn around it was a lot of different like i don't know why it was it was kind of packed for a Sunday. So it was lots of groups of, of guys just like in little sections. So we walking down the street and it was like some guys that was behind us. They would be like, oh, she good, she good. Oh my oh, God, she I'm so <laughs> embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed. <clears throat> Look, so I was just like, I, I'm giving everybody attitude at this point because it was, nine was the drunkest and then it was the other girl. Um, and then it was another girl and then it was me so i'm like y'all bitches everybody get the fuck over here and let's go everybody veering off going other places because they drunk and i'm trying to hold everybody i'm like all right come on come on let's go let's go so oh my God. so we ended up um, we ended up going past this like little gay bar and they have like outside patio and, and stuff like that where you can just sit and um, drink and stuff. So we passing them and they're like, oh, y'all need to go get that drunk bitch some fucking water. How rude of you. To exactly. They're so right How though. stupid of you to think I was going to let you just say that. So I, I turned my happy ass around and I said, who the fuck? do you think you're talking to oh my god i got all in his face and i'm and he like you you um 
He was like, you ignorant ass bitches. And I'm like, nigga, I will, be ignorant. I will put my hands on you, sir. Like, and I told him that. And he ended up coming up to us a little later. And he was like, oh, do you need me to call you guys an Uber? Yeah, you was trying to make up for it because you said some slick shit. Mm -hmm. And if you see this, because I just feel like it's a possibility that you <laughs> might. You have to be watching this. You have to. And I want you to learn your lesson. Yeah. Do not speak out of your mouth about a situation you know nothing about because if i decided to be mean and punch <laughs> you in your face you will be feeling crazy no, facts, though. for Girl, real though i was not there for none of that i was yes. there but i was not there like i don't know i don't remember yeah at this point she was like she was already like if y'all seen like imagine like y'all seen drunk i know y'all seen drunk people before but she was laying on the concrete in front of in everybody. In front of everybody. Oh my god. And and, and I look. Can't I can't I'm like, nah, get up, get up. And she like dead weight at this point. Like she was already like pass out kind of drunk before we even got back to the car. So <clears throat> then we are walking and we hold in like arm and arm or shoulder and shoulder with the other girls. It was these guys behind us and you end up falling he goes to try to grab you instead of us is that when i twisted my ankle possibly we pushing the guy off because i mean first of all you didn't ask could you like i mean i see you trying to help but like we got this it's three of it's three of us helping her why right. do you feel like you should push us out the way to try to help her instead we're her friends you are just somebody that she had a dress on and they felt like she was fine they've been following us they've been walking with us and it was just some weird stuff yeah. so um our other friend was like no move the fuck out of the way move like we got her we see what you're doing and we got her and he was with a girl and she tried to fight us and i'm like yeah. because i'm not sure why <clears throat> okay so basically she just got done telling me that somebody bought me a pizza and i said bitch you got five seconds yeah that i'm so if you're watching this please please just know that that was not me i would never i would never do that if you bought me a whole freaking pizza like I, honestly when i heard that it tore my soul i wanted to cry i'm not kidding like i'm so for real Girl. because you buy me a whole pizza and then i said bitch you got five seconds you don't even know me and you bought me a pizza like i'm so sorry i'm so what oh you mean my other bro okay here we go Girl, uh, we had to switch phones because it was gonna die I mean, there was no space. Yeah, it was no space. What was we saying? You were about to say don't something, and then it cut off. And I, cause I was talking about um, this girl bought me a pizza, and then I said, Oh yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> don't drink four locos because, or don't don't drinking is not really alcohol. Don't taste good. Um, it hurt. <laughs> it your can liver. hurt. <laughs> it hurts your liver. Mm -hmm. It can hurt you on the outside. It can hurt you on the inside. And it, you really don't need it. You know, you can do other things. Honestly, I mean, the girl, she was understanding though. She, I told them that that she don't mean it. She just drunk. They was like, yeah, it's okay. Um, have a good day or whatever, and make sure like you get home safe. As we were walking down the street, um, she fell for a second time. And it was like when we were walking across the street, you had fell. And we trying to like, you not trying to get up on your, you not trying to get up, you was trying to stay down. So we dragging you to get to the other side of the street. And when we got there, you was like, no, get off of me. Let me just lay down. And you laid down and you, you tried to call your mom. And when she didn't answer, I feel like that's what like started the, the like, yeah, that part of it after that she was just like upset and if you drink you know you have like a couple different options of drunk oh yeah you have there's uh, different levels to that yeah, shit. It's different <laughs> levels. so you have a calm drunk you got like a, a silly drunk and you got an angry drunk and that angry drunk you will fire on anybody oh my god and so when that one thing when that one thing triggered like you know how if you have a bad day or if you having like a bad time in life or or whatever the case is and you holding all of it in and then it's like when you drunk you can relax you your brain relaxes so once you try you can't hold in the things that you were 
holding it in when you were sober because you know yeah. how to do it when you're sober but, but when you drunk you're like first of all i don't care no more yeah i'm gonna, like, I, I'm gonna the, let it go you lose the you lose you do lose respect because i lost all my respect you lose like your dignity if that makes sense like you just yeah. don't care you just don't care you don't care what it's basically <laughs> whatever comes to your mind you gonna let it out it's it's no if ands no buts that's how it is and it's just for local will bring that out of you for local is a thing that will bring that mean for locals <laughs> for locals <laughs> listen so oh she so we like nah come on come on let's go to the car he was like no get the fuck off me was this in front of everybody like, if you tell me yes. this was but it was like no, no 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 they were across the street they weren't like right up on us it wasn't like they were across the street they was looking from a distance because it it looked like it was about to be a big ass girl fight like, <laughs> yes it looked like that so she ends up our other friend one of our other friends end up saying come on she's trying to talk to her calmly and nicely down it like down close to her in her face um come on you know let's just get to the car it's like bitch you ain't my friend back up <laughs> oh my god guys guys <laughs> was like, bitch, you oh ain't my, my friend god. back up and you was laying on the floor and then she got like she like jumped or whatever and then she was just like no nah, you don't really mean that you don't really mean that you was like bitch yes i do get the fuck out of my face and she walked away and she started walking to your car i didn't know at that time she's the one that had your keys so she was going to the car and she was like no I'm, i just can't do this i can't do this um me and the other girl because I, like i was telling you it was four of us so one's walking to the car, Nye's on the floor, I'm in front of Nye, and the other girl is on the side of me. We go to pick you up, and that's you bowing us. You like, I am so. You like, get the fuck I off of me. Stop this. saying sorry. I because cannot at this, hear this story right now, it's not, it was like, at this point, we weren't even like, it wasn't to the point of upset yet. We was just a little aggravated at this point. Because we was trying to get her to the car. And it was just a little like... It's like, you know how when you're trying to like... Get your um get your kid to do what you want them to do. And they're like, no! I'm going to do what I want to do! It was that oh. kind of situation. So I'm like, no! Get to the car! <laughs> She's she like, no! She just knocked me out. I would have much rather preferred her to knock me the fuck out and drag my ass to my car. Because all the shit that happened in the midst of this is un... I cannot. And she just Bro. said that it was one of the most packed Sundays. I literally want to fucking just fucking drown no. right now because look i oh, now that i'm thinking about it this shit was funny as fuck and thinking about it from some seeing this hearing this from somebody else's perspective i know y'all are dying laughing I know. because oh my god this is not even something to feel bad about this is more of like a learning experience this yes, is like no. a, this is like i feel like we needed this situation to tell us drinking is not is the way to have fun. fun. Drinking is not the way to go if you are dealing with a yeah. lot. Drinking is not a way to cope with stuff. Drinking is drinking, drinking. is like fun. Drinking yeah. is fun when you do it the right the way. The right when you're way. You're feeling the right way, and you mm -hmm. you know you don't sat, like abuse it. Yeah. And which was what I was doing. Oh my god! I honestly deserve to be humiliated to humiliate myself like that because i'm such a dumb bitch no oh see God. it wasn't and y'all to me she's saying that but it wasn't even like that to me you know i feel like it was literally just she got a little bit too drunk she just was going through a lot and she didn't have no way to like really let it out so i feel like I feel like your drunk self is at peace. <laughs> yes, girl. Though, your drunk, my drunk self, self is. I'm never peace. gonna get to that level ever again in my life. That was the first. No, that wasn't the first. <laughs> that was the third and last time. <laughs> okay. I'm that sorry. third time. After the third time, fuck it. We done. I'm done. You, that was God. You t you told us. Thank you. And we accept. I, I see we, now. We accept. For some reason, this one made me see the bigger <laughs> picture. Because now I see. 
<laughs> and I'm just looking at this shit like, fuck no. Okay, what were you saying? Um, 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 where was that? Okay. Nye ends up saying something that hurt our other friend feelings about something that she going through or whatever. She was like, well, what the fuck did you say to me? Say it again, say it again. And you said, bitch, I said this. And you said it again. <laughs> she thought you didn't get it from a bitter ass. Get it from a bitter ass. And I said, not if I beat your ass, bitch. Oh my God, no. And you got that up. That is so out of character for me, y'all. I'm not That's like that. That's what I'm saying. You know. This was my first fight. I've never <laughs> fought before. This, this was my first fight. And I'm 20 years old. <laughs> Go ahead, keep going. I'm and not. I'm like, nah. And I'm like, nah. At this point, me and I are full on yelling at each other. We are dead ass, like we're nose to nose, touching, yelling in each other's face. And I'm like, nah, I'm your fucking friend. I'm your friend. I'm your friend. You was like, <laughs> you was like, I don't know why the fuck I decided to come out with these lousy bitches. Oh my, like, oh my god, I can't I take this. Crying. I can't take this shit. I swear, I can't. No, listen. I cannot. At that point, I literally stopped to laugh. It, everything <laughs> was going on, but I was crying <laughs> laughing. <laughs> 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 And then I, I haven't heard like, the word lousy in a long time. I know. <laughs> Bitch, you said it. I'm like, what the fuck? This old school ass word. I was, I was, what got into me? Bro, it was just like, and then it was okay. When we first got there, it, oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Before I say that, after that situation <laughs> and I got up trying to fight the um our other friend or whatever, and I got Nye, I, I literally had to grab you by your neck and slang you for you to get away from, from her. Because you was, like, going at her, like, with your fists up, like, trying to fight oh her. Oh, my God, y'all. No. And oh so, so um, she had left. And she went with our other friend to the car. She met her at the car. And so, I'm still trying to get you. Mind you, I'm still thinking. I'm thinking they can't get in the car. I'm thinking that I got the keys in your purse. I'm not knowing she got the key. So I'm like, nah, come on. We just got to get to the car. I'm going to drive your car to your house. And then we're going to be good. So that was what, that was another setback that had pissed me off. That was the one. I feel like that was the first thing that had p pissed me off. Because we had could, that we could have been gone. <laughs> I'm still, I'm steady trying to get her to the car. Mind you, it's me. It's me by myself at this point. And um, she like dead weight. Because I, like I told y'all, she was like the passed out kind of drunk. So I'm having to tell you little lies. I'm having to say, like, once we get to the car, I can get you some food. Once we get to the car, I'll give you this. Once we get to the car, I'll take you to your mom because I know your mom not answering. But what if what if you see her in person? What if that? <laughs> well, you never know. You I never know. know. Let's just get to the car and I'll show you. <laughs> Maybe you'll find out there. Okay, okay. Maybe we just go to the car. You'll be good. Skip a little bit. We make it to the car. When we get to the car, um, I see that they're not there. And I I set you up on the um on, I sit you down by the car in front of the car, <clears throat> and you was instantly like lay down. You was like, um, but it threw up, Ooh. and then all of a sudden you start throwing up everywhere. You choking on your throw up. Oh, I'm holding. Wow. I'm I'm turning your head to the side. You throwing up everywhere, and I'm like, nah, nah, your hair. <laughs> And you was like, you was letting it fall on your chest. And I was like, nah, come on. You got clothes in the trunk. And I looked through that bag, but you ain't had no shirt. You, you had pants Oh, because those only. pants, those are my old Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I fucking, those are my old pants when oh. I was skinny. <laughs> I was going to take them to Goodwill. <laughs> Bro, so I'm like, oh, Lord, she is not going to want to store up in her car. They need to hurry up so I can get in the car and look see at, if I can get Look at her like stuff. being such a good friend the whole time, knowing that I wouldn't want that. And and you did a good job because there's no throw up in my car. Good, bro. Because I was like, bro, I just know. And I'm like, nah, come on. We've got to get it together. Get it together. Try. I say, now that you threw up, come on, relax. Breathe. Get it. Sober up. <laughs> Let's go. And I'm still waiting for them. And so they called me. And they was like, they were going to just take an Uber to your house and get their car and just go. I don't blame them. And I'm like, okay, that's fine. Bring me the keys. That's all I care about. Bring me the keys. I'm not trying to be here no more. It's 3 o'clock at this time. And we didn't leave till 4.30, oh mind you. God. So it's still kind of early in the situation. So 
um, we they finally come with the with the keys and you trying to drive. And I'm like, nah, get in the back seat. Get in the back seat and you can use my phone and try to call your mom because you thought her phone was going straight to voicemail. I feel like it was dead or whatever the case may be. But you thought she blocked you. I said that I got my phone, get it from the back seat, get in the back seat, and we can and you can call her. <laughs> and so you looking in the back seat and you see that you wasn't trying to get in the car and you see my phone wasn't actually in the back seat and it was in my hand you turn around instantly you manipulated me <laughs> <laughs> and you like you had you had buddy me while you talking oh like you you manipulated me you lied and i'm like i'm like okay now nah, okay okay and i'm like and you sit down and so Pat come back and sh and we go to your trunk and we see that you had a, the husky jacket, the colorful one, and the trunk. I'm like, come on, we gonna put this over her so we can get in the car without getting the throw up from your dress and stuff, getting in the car, shit like that. And right when we put the jacket on you, you take it off and throw up on the jacket. I say shit. I am. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with you. I say shit, bro. Then that's when you started getting like mad again. And you was like, bro, I don't got no friends. Everybody just think I'm this and I'm that. And I just don't have anybody but myself. And I'm like, nah, I'm, I'm trying to help you. Come on, bro. Come on, get in the car. And you still didn't want to get in the car. But at this time, they are, um, it's like 345, 3, something like that. And, and they had called your, your brother or Zach was trying to call your brother. You had talked to Zach multiple times and he was just like, nah nah you okay it's okay nah it's gonna be okay and you was just like um you was like no because i'm not okay i just don't i no, no everybody's manipulating me and i just i, I can't do this oh my and God. i was like i was like nah no yo like so, what the fuck <laughs> oh my god so embarrassing so no we got um i walked away and i started talking on the phone with zach and your keys were on the top of the on the sunroof part on top of the car mm -hmm. and but your car you i guess you was in the vicinity or whatever so you know you can push the button mm -hmm. so you pushed the button and you was trying to leave and i'm like girl yo, how you get in a car and don't see the keys on the top you <laughs> obviously can't drive so give me these keys i take them off the top and oh. i go and I, I put them behind my back it took you like 10 minutes to realize that you couldn't go nowhere because you didn't actually have the keys. So you get out the car and I'm holding my phone in this hand, the keys in this hand behind my back. And oh. you was like, you was like, um, give me my fucking keys. I worked my hard, my whole life to get this motherfucking car. And you think you're gonna take my fucking keys, bitch? How bitch you at? <laughs> everybody that even witnessed that version of me i would <laughs> no it was bro afterwards <sighs> i listen i literally was up all night like feeling so bad bro, I, don't I don't know why because bro i just feel like i could have like like no, ran away from no. her no you like, needed to beat my ass <laughs> no after everything you told me you should have been beat my ass. <laughs> no, bro, cuz I just feel oh like my God. I don't but we not even we wasn't even there yet. I mean, we we was almost there. We was almost there. But I'm like, "Nah. Go sit the fuck down. Go sit down. Go sit down. Go get in the car and sit down. Go sit down." And you just like yelling in my face and you try to grab my phone thinking that it was your keys. And you grab my phone, and I'm I'm showing you. I'm literally holding my phone up to your face, showing you that they not your your keys. They my phone, and you steady trying to grab it out my hand. Say, give me my keys, and I'm saying this is a oh phone. <laughs> so then you see that it's a phone, and you throw it at me, and I'm like, no. I'm like, nah. I say, nah. You got one more time, nah. You got one more time, nah. And you was like, well, what the fuck are you gonna do, bitch? <laughs> And oh I'm like, God. I'm like, nah. 
Nye, Nye, back up, Nye, back up, back up, back up, back up. And then we headbutt. And then after that, we That's just start we fighting. fighting. Yes. <laughs> no. So we fought twice. We fought twice? Yes. Damn. I feel like. Oh, yeah, because you did say I said I got back up or something? Yes. Cause I we fought the first time and I like slung her. It's that's probably when you messed your your foot up a little bit more because when you was getting up, like you literally was like jumping up <laughs> trying to come back. And like you slid out. Oh my god, no. And I'm like, nah, stay down, stay the fuck down. And you was like, he's like, no, come on, bitch. <laughs> and the first time, look, the first time my wig stayed on. The first oh my time god. my wig was still on. <sighs> And then the second time, you was like, no, come on. And your nails were on the first time still, too. Really? That's how I know so that it, it was the, the second, second part. Time. Yes. So I'm like, um, like, nah, stay the fuck down. Like, move back up. That's when you, you grabbed my wig and you had that bitch. So my head was down. And then that's how your, your. My nails no, came off? What? Your, from my, I'm, I think it's from my hair. But that's my head was down like this, and that's how you got this right here. Oh, you because because I did like this. Oh, y'all look. You guys probably can't see it, but yeah, she got me real good right here. <laughs> she got me real good right on. right there. You can see it. <laughs> look at no, the great lady. Yeah, you fucking glowing <laughs> that after glow. <laughs> that after your first fight glow <laughs> is really hitting right now. <laughs> Bro, no. but no. One thing I'll say, you stuck me one good fucking time. Really? Right in the eye. Guys. And I said, oh, that's how I knew I, sl I slung you again. And as you was getting up, I said, no, we're not going to do this. And as you was trying to get up, I just pushed you back oh, down. No. And I got on her and I put both of my knees on either one of her <laughs> arms. And she was like, I, I, I. And uh, mind you, I had a dress on. She was trying to bite my cooter cat. And I was like, I was like, you're trying to bite my cooch. You're trying to bite my cooch. Mind y'all, I, oh my, God. my wig is completely off. My wig is sitting directly one centimeter next to the throw up. <laughs> Listen, my, I had my Negro braids out and I'm sitting there on top of her I'm holding so the sides of her hand. Sorry. No, it's Guys, at this point, I was laughing again. We, we were laughed laughing? together. We did. We laughed oh, no, together. That was after. I, I remember a yes. little bit of that. We laughed together, and I was holding. I was holding her like this by her head, so she wouldn't bite my cooch. Guys, I start. Wait, hold on. We started laughing. Yes. We're crazy. Oh. I said, "Not nah, you gonna bite my fucking coochie?" He said, "Yeah." <laughs> I said, no, bitch. I knew. I know that's when you knew. I'm fucking crazy. <laughs> <laughs> and so no. after some time had passed i'm like okay nah if i let you go with you will you stop will you stop he's like yes i'm done i'm done and i knew you was a little bit more like um like more i definitely sober. like when when that after the fight because the thing is like i don't remember everything but like i remember certain parts but i remember being more sober in that moment after the fight because yes. i remember being like don't feel bad like i remember telling you like don't yeah. feel bad you simply just reacted like there's nothing you could have done and but then mm. it was like i was in and out because there was hella shit that my brother was telling me that i did when i got home that i don't mm. remember either yeah he called zach after and he was saying how um y'all was you were in the shower and you was trying to talk and tell him that how um <laughs> he told he said that you were trying to tell him how he was like he wasn't right and he wasn't listening to you the car ride and stuff like that oh yeah and i was like like, you wasn't listening. You was like, no, because listen, because listen, I just know we no listen. You wasn't even making full words. <laughs> it's like something was wanting to come out, but yeah, I couldn't but you just couldn't, I couldn't say, it. say it. And he was like, yeah, mm-hmm, yeah, yeah. My brother mm -hmm. is so patient with me. He was, he was. He didn't get mad at nothing that that you said, or you. He was, he just like, yeah, okay, well, we just gonna we gonna we gonna help you. We gonna this this is this. this. He was saying he had cleaned your fingers up. Bro, I had knew it. I was saying, nah, let me clean you up. Let me clean Bro, you up. Bro, look, y'all. It came, my nails came off. For my girls that love nails, <laughs> it's never worth it. Look, now I can't wear nails for a long time. Listen, but he was like, he was like, when he seen you, he knew that it was like, 
it wasn't you wasn't yourself i was just like after the fight like literally directly after the fight we just started talking about it saying how sorry we was we did not waste no time because guys like i honestly listen that is so unlike me like i'm not like that at all like i'm literally like if you if you you can ask anybody and i i can say this with pride with everything i'm mm-hmm. not a problematic person like people will not talk about people i'll say how i feel the truth of my side but I'll, you'll never see me ever come up to you and start talking shit about somebody mm-hmm. i'm not that type of person let alone fight right. or cause the chaos that i was causing I just, I put myself in these stupid, crazy situations as, like, I'm so dumb, like, ugh. I feel like it was just, like, a learning experience, honestly, because I've never had a situation where, it was new for me, too, because I never had a situation with somebody where I fought them and was able to apologize, be cool, be, like, be able to do this right now. I've never had that. I It's always been after a fight, and that's it. That's, even if I, even if I wanted to be friends with them still or even if I didn't feel even if I didn't have no ill intention you know like that Mm -hmm. it's I've never had a situation like like this where we can talk to y'all and tell y'all how it's not when you growing up and you're a teenager you a young adult it's like you want to drink you feel like the party life is where it's supposed to be and I mean as long as you're doing it responsibly and making sure you're not overdoing it or or drinking to cover up something else then that's fine but make sure you're doing that because like we showing you right now a negative outcome it could be far worse it could be it could be like a situation you couldn't went to jail exactly oh yeah a police came after two police cars came after and it was like oh um we got reports of a fight and we was like what are you talking about mind you her nails dripping blood (laughs) she mangled up she fucked and i'm like i'm like not was your wig off bitch yes my well i had i stuck it right on my head but they seen that it was pushed all the way back it was half on and they just like what do you mean they like y'all bitches lying y'all bitch. and that's the thing i could have went to jail and mm-hmm. that would have been so much more humiliating than this moment right now because i know my mom would have had to get me out of jail for something so stupid for something mm-hmm. so stupid oh. yeah and so we was like at this time her brother was on the way so it was like we fine police we just waiting for the ride because we just got a little bit too drunk you know girls argue sometimes and that's just what it was we talking about it and we straight he was like, oh, we just gonna sit here until it, um, until your ride get here, I guess, to make sure we wasn't lying, because they seen throw up and stuff like that, so they knew we was drunk, but, um, <clears throat> then we started talking, and he came over with, like, water and napkins and stuff like that, and he was like, clean yourself up, and you, I was like, <laughs> what the, do you want to get beat up, sir, <laughs> officer, because what are you talking oh about? Oh my god. It's like, my thing is i feel like sometimes in a group that's family it it comes to stuff like this Mm -hmm. but the what make or break a relationship or what make or break a friendship is what you do after yeah that's true so i feel like that's why i'm saying it's no it's no apology needed just for the simple fact that i consider her now my family so it's like we have a, we have fights that's fine it's yeah. it's okay to fight but as long as you realize that that you're family and that you don't want to let something that that's not that's not that serious i know that that's yeah. not you so i can't be mad i can't be like no i don't like not because she did this this and i know that's not you that was out of your character yeah. because of a substance that that we decided to do or i mean not a substance an alcohol what is called a beverage a beverage that we decided to do so it's not like i'm gonna say no fuck you i'm gonna always even even in the mix you know even even if i said something that that hurt her or she said something that hurt me at the time i'm never gonna just walk away because i would rather you be mad at me or we have a fight than like I give you your keys and just say fuck you and you and you drive yeah. off and some shit happen to you. I would rather wow. a fight than uh than me never talk to you again because I'm I'm acting out of my anger and and some stuff that I know is not even you. 
you don't find people like that no more like literally exactly. honestly thank you janae like janae yeah. thank you for yeah. real like that whole that whole situation basically and also what she's trying to say with what she's saying with the whole outcome thing it's like i could have let my pride be like oh i'm leaving the group I'm this, I'm and that's that, what I was scared and I'm of. Gonna, too. And I'm never gonna talk to her. And I'm gonna do this, and I'm gonna do. But for what? But for what? What? What would that do? Nothing. What I? What I immediately? What you immediately do in moments like that? It's like you sit and think, okay, where the fuck did I fuck up? Where did I fuck up? What did I do wrong? Why did this happen? And you change, and you don't do it again. You don't do it no more. Mm -hmm. And just how she accepted me for me being a you know chaotic as i was then i'm accepting her what how sh her reaction you know what i mean because if i was in her shoes and however she handled it i accept it i'm not gonna i'm not just gonna let my pride get in the way of me and be like nah you you this you that you did no mm -hmm. because now you have to think about the whole story not just your not just yourself not just mm -hmm. and guys listening to everything that she just said let me tell you I was cringing. I was cringing. I'm embarrassed. I'm ashamed. I literally am gonna go home and cry about this. No. No. There's nothing we can do. It's gonna happen, bitch. I can't. I can't. No. Like I'm literally gonna. I already know. I'm just gonna cry, cry, cry. Because you just need to make the right choices, and it is okay to make mistakes. Look, I am publicly. I just publicly made that mistake. Like it wasn't just like a mistake I made behind. And it's so weird because I was talking about that in a video that I filmed. You make your mistakes and you learn from them. You don't remake the same mistakes. If you see that you're in the same spot that you're in, it's because you keep doing the same thing. And then it's like, it keeps happening to me. And now I'm just, I don't want to drink no more. Well, it's not that I don't. It's, <laughs> it's, not, it's not, not that we, drink. it's not that we're not going to drink. It's that we're, we prefer light lighter drinking mm -hmm. now because we see the heavier drinking is not, not right said. like you like you have to be conscious at all times at least just like in a fun moment you want to let loose you don't want to be as in like you know then you just get tipsy like not drunk but y'all let me tell you pick your friends wisely yeah. because if something was to happen and you were drinking not everybody will react how i reacted and you don't want to be in a situation where your friends just leave. You don't want to be in a situation where you're uh, passed out drunk, or if you, even if you're a female, especially if you're a female, you don't want to be passed out drunk by yourself and anything could happen. You don't want to be a guy and drunk and get in an argument with your friend and you speed off and something and you drunk driving and something happened. God for, forbid, you know, you don't want to be that. So you want to make sure one, you're not drinking that much too you're not drunk driving because that's not good we not doing that no more because we we've done stuff that we regret yes that's the that's really the bottom line but we learn from our experiences i don't think this is gonna ever happen again because i felt so bad y'all i literally stayed up till like eight o'clock in the morning like staring at the wall thinking about naya leaving the group no. honestly because i felt so i felt like i felt like i was being a bully that's how i felt i felt like i was bullying you and i Why i felt i don't know i don't know i don't know i felt like i i could have went easier on you i felt like i could have like just thrown you and I don't know. I could have just like tried to run no, away. Jamie, I don't know. You did what you did. <laughs> you did nothing wrong. The wrong person here is me, okay? And I kept trying to tell you that like before when yeah, we you left, was I was like, don't too. feel bad because I knew that she did. And I was like, don't, don't, yeah. don't, don't, and don't. And that's the first thing I texted her. As soon as I woke up, I was like, like I said, I'm not, I wasn't lying when I said you should not feel bad. You simply just reacted. Like you have to come mm -hmm. on now. What else could you have done? just yeah. think about that what else could you have done you did the most that you could do and you did everything with great intentions i feel like i also feel like it's just because i'm like a i'm uh i'm a, a fighter she is a fighter yeah. <laughs> she is a, the trust me up, okay? when i get frustrated or when i get angry or when i feel like i'm at my like end that's how I think to react regardless. So once I was put in a position to where like, I felt like she was just gonna keep coming. She was gonna keep coming. I just felt like that's just what it was. But I feel, that's where I feel like I fucked up. 
I feel like I should be more, I should be more peace. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I should be more peace. I should have tried my best to look for another avenue that we could have took so we didn't have to get to this to this point that's why i feel like i had a part to play and and fucking like potentially fucking shit up because you could like you said you could have just been like fuck everything fuck this fuck you fuck all of this and been done and that would that would be something that i would i would be responsible for because i feel like i could have looked for other avenues i just picked the first thing that came to my mind and did it that's why I feel like I'm fucked up for it. Oh, well, I honestly, if you think that's not, that's not a bad way to think. That's a good way to yeah. think. But if you ask me, I feel like you did what you had to do. <laughs> Stop saying First of all, <laughs> first of all, from the second after we fought, she was like, damn, girl, you did that. <laughs> I said that. <laughs> Bro. That was my first fight, y'all. That was my first fight. And y'all, when I tell you, she got me one good time, like, dead in my dead eyeball. I... <laughs> and I'm like, ooh, Lauda and Jay. I don't ever want to fight again. I don't ever want to fight again. I'm not a fighter. Like, we're the complete opposite of each other. <laughs> She's like, she, you know what's so funny? We are the complete opposite of each other. We are. She's like more calmer, right? But she's still fun, like... But she's more on the calmer end of things. I'm more mm -hmm. of the like, ee, ee, ee. yeah. <laughs> but and then I hate fighting. Like I'm not a fighter. And then she's like, I'm gonna beat you. We're like the complete opposite of each other, bro. And that's why. And that's another reason I was like, what the fuck? Cause I'm, I would compare myself more of a tomboy. I would compare myself more of the down and dirty. I, like I'm not the down and dirty. Down and dirty. <laughs> I like. Like I would do mud slides. I would do a little like oh, tomboy stuff. Mean. You get what more I mean? More adventurous, like I feel like I'm more of shit. yeah of the yeah nine runs like a girl. I'm like, <laughs> like you know, like you do know, everything there. like, like a mosquito. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she does everything like a girl. So I'm just like, bro. Oh my god. This. Oh. I don't know if y'all can see that. Oh yeah. That's a better thumbnail. Come on, read basically take from this it doesn't there's it doesn't always have to be war there's gonna be war regardless but choose mm -hmm. peace peace is peace. better yes. Peace is so much better and don't be me do not yes you're gonna make your mistakes but do not get drunk and go to ebor on a freaking <laughs> sunday because now i'm not going to ebor i'm not going to ebor for three months <laughs> because I'm no crying. they are not gonna remember and hold on let me put this out to the guy that was asking us to buy his cd and any cash shop will help and then he see me and her on the on the ground and started recording yeah just in case you post your video stinking broke dusty soundcloud stupid ass boy he fighting no he oh. got he got when okay so like we were saying she like i was saying she was saying that how i'm not her friend and that i'm trying to take her i was she was saying i was trying to take her somewhere she didn't want to go so he was trying to be a good samaritan even though an hour ago you just came up to us we were all walking together and you asked us could we give you five dollars for your cd so why do you feel like he talking about some let her go she don't want to go with you you trying to human traffic her oh my god you just seen me and asked me to send you five dollars for your mixtape so how am i trying to traffic her now and if you see this video i hope you don't blow up <laughs> i hope your cd who even makes stuff on cds no more <laughs> upload your stuff on youtube why are you trying to get by the cd and a business card for soundcloud songs <laughs> yes like you your stuff is not on youtube you are only on soundcloud and selling cds how do you feel like it? You haven't even made a bit. He haven't even released the song. Exactly. So worry about that five dollars in them cash shops and stop worrying about us. Just in case you're seeing this, Dusty. Very what she said. <laughs> what she said. <laughs> Wait, what's that on TikTok? Straight like that. <laughs> Straight like that. What she said. Exactly. <laughs> as much as I I am thinking in my head, I wish last night never happened. It happened for a reason, you guys. And from here on out. I will understand why <laughs> why the fuck this happened. I think it's honestly to stop me from drinking the way that I drink. I really feel because now I'm definitely like not gonna like that's humiliating. No, look, what's crazy is why the, why my little press on's basically stayed on. Her shit. Okay, 
Her? Whoa, that's so true. I just realized that. I lost Only two. Only two. I and and two. it wasn't like, it didn't snap off, but it's just still mm -hmm. there. That glue is good. I wrinkled a couple of them. <laughs> that's weird as fuck though. That's that's some good ass glue. Yeah, yeah, and then also it's not worth it. If you get your nose done, it's, if you it's get not your worth it. Done. And the wig too, it's not worth it. <laughs> yes, but guess what? What? Now I'm confident to wear my nigglet braids outside. Really? <laughs> I had my like... negro braids out for an hour. Did I got you... five braids under here. Did you like look at yourself in the mirror and be like, oh, this is... But we looked at each other. We looked at each other for over like three minutes, like face to face with my wig off. I don't know how you don't remember it was off. I, I'm just looking at you with my peanut head and you just looking at me and we just laughing and we oh just like, God. it was a, oh my goodness. Uh, all right, guys, it's time to end this video off because it's 40 oh minutes. This is going to be a long video. I'm not going to make cuts. I'm not going to make too much cuts. Mm -hmm. But yeah, guys, this is raw, natural, everything. Like literally the day after, like, like, comment, and subscribe on the video and and if you want to have more little story times or whatever, we can like just do little stuff like this. Probably on like our a personal yeah, YouTube we can do or girl something talk like that. If you guys fuck with these for mm -hmm. real. If y'all want like little trial and errors in life, mm -hmm. <laughs> then oh, we just can tell all our fucking stories. Yes. Oh, uh, the ring light went out. This Guess fighting what that is means. so much better. Okay, guys, that, that means we yeah, gotta fight. <laughs> all right, bye, y'all. Bye.